Hi, I'm John Barry, the United States Ambassador to Australia. This month, all across Australia, events are being held to mark 70 years since the Allied victory in the Pacific, which finally brought an end to World War II. Earlier this year, I took part in ceremonies here in Canberra commemorating the 73rd anniversary of the Battle of the Coral Sea. The battles of the Coral Sea and Midway were pivotal moments in history, the critical one-two punch that turned the tide of the entire war. During these two engagements, thousands of Allied sailors and airmen sailed and flew, bravely facing flames and smoke and sea. Some made the ultimate sacrifice for their countries. They did all this in order to achieve victory. I was proud to represent the United States at a Coral Sea Memorial event this year in Canberra. And at that event, I had the honor of meeting Mr. Gordon Johnson and Mr. Derek Holyoke. In thanks for their service, I presented U.S. flags to these two Coral Sea veterans and Australian heroes. These two gentlemen served aboard the HMAS Hobart, which was also part of the expeditionary force that delivered the 1st Marine Division, including my own father, to Guadalcanal in 1942. Mr. Johnson sent me these remarkable images of the Allied preparations and assault on Guadalcanal. He was a telegraph operator aboard the Hobart during the battle. His position provided him with the opportunity to capture these amazingly important moments in history. It's a unique insight into a critical moment of the Second World War where Americans fought side by side with their Australian mates to repel the Japanese advance. We are forever grateful for their brave service. As we reflect on the past 70 years of peace and prosperity in the Pacific, we celebrate the U.S.-Australia alliance that has made this possible.